Seriki Fulani of Igwa in Yewa North Local Government Area of Ugu State, Adamo Ibrahim, has said more than 100 Fulani S-men were killed in the area within the last five years. This, the Seriki Fulani said, was the beginning of the recent attacks on communities in Yewa Aziz of the state. In his words, communities like Asha, Agbon, Ujodu, and others along Ojaodon Aziz had killed many cows and headers during the period. While speaking in an exclusive interview with Daily Post, he said he had lost counts of how many cows were killed within the last five years, stating that over 100 headers were killed for no just reason. Hmm, now oh, wow. Southerners on a weekend share. Hey, these people didn't do anything. Ah, and you just kept taking their lives. You just kept keeping killing their cows. How? Oh, what an injustice. Hey. Southern as Ibadan people are be or your people or your people are very wicked. These people did not do anything. And they started just taking them. Hell. What a story. What a story. If we are not smart in this country, because these people have laid the foundation of like, oh, yes, we are not one. All this one they are talking about uh, Nigeria is it's a lie. Unless you are just going to be lying to yourselves, unless you are not going to be telling your conscience the truth because the way a man at which these people are going if nigerians are not if other tribes are not as uh, as smart as possible or as far as soon as possible these people they will turn everything upside down they will turn everything upside down and unfortunate thing now is that you that you are crying other tribes that are crying here and there the government is not ready to listen to them not at all if care is not taken these people will change the narratives and for as many who care to listen will we want to listen to what they are saying. That's why people must be, on, you know, there's fire on the man. See, those who are still saying 2023 is a is a pity, is a pity. Because what we see every day, you can't just you can't just hide your feelings. You can't just hide your emotions. You can't just hide the truth. You can't just to be on the fence and begin to say, oh, everything is fine. Because these people are coming and giving it raw, just like that. They and they want you to be quiet. No. And not to say anything, this is very, very unfortunate. We have a lot of people from that year one and they have gone to Benin Republic. They can't go there. They say they don't even want to come back. A lot of them have moved. They are now refugees in other places, living their own place. And that is exactly what these people really want. By the time Igbo comes out again, now you people will now be shouting. Be shouting. Well, my thought on Fulani S men being killed is a lie. False justification to cover the evil being done on innocent villagers. God will help us all. Amen. Oh. Not true. Naysay as propagandist, inciting, insinuating, misinforming the public. Well, they deceive, they deserve death. <laughs> the Sarki Fulani is the actor, and you know whenever the actor dies, film finish. Liars. Ewu kid must be killed. No Fulani person deserves to live from Asu Rock down to the forest. How can they be killing your people and you still allow your people to live there? Please pack and go and killing will stop. Seriki Fulani, you are a liar. You are just lying. The Seriki Fulani is the actor and you know uh, when the actor has not died. When the actor dies, our film don't finish now. No comments. These people are full of evil in all ramifications. If over 100 of you were killed, why are you still operating in that area? You remember that you did you did it to an old man like a Olufalaye. <laughs> oh, Mr. Man, you can lie for Africa. He's lucky only 100 for five years. Those that are killing Funanis, they should stop it. Otherwise, peace will never be in their land. What have you said since they have been killing? When people or when some people tell lies, they think others listening are Mumu. How can you allege that your fellow herdsmen were being killed without provocation the whole country know the incidents of the average herdsmen with their concomitant con con raping family destruction and moreover kidnapping culture and this fulani is saying absolute rubbish issue uh, look um, for another lies to tell stop lying mr uh, seriki fulani stop lying why are you lying something that is very obvious your presence is being felt all over the country and you are coming in to tell us that uh, these people are doing this and you are doing the same thing you go to other people's farm 
or to people's hand to destroy their crops and you come out and say your people are being killed. The Sarki Fulani is the actor. The statement is one-sided. What is the number of those killed, raped and kidnapped by the Fulani head S-men? How can S may be killed without a reason? You are biased against the Yoruba. Evil people like you have the war are the ones causing confusion all over the country. Human without brain. Yes, that is the beginning of Fulani uh, death in Ogun. I think Fulani said we are wicked. We are already we are ready for you this time around. Even Buari will cry over Fulani's death. When you keep by the sword, you die by the sword. When you keep by AK-47, you die by AK-47. When you keep by fire, you die by fire. Hmm. The claim uh, may not be true. The claim may not be true, but they are only trying to cover up their evil activities within the said period. I beg, shift. Can you count how many innocent people you, the Fulanese, have killed? They say no. They say they don't know anything about all the things you are saying. No. All the allegations levied against them. They say they don't even know what the people are talking about. That they know, they don't know. They, they have never done anything. They are, they are they themselves, they are victims of a, a, a kidnapping. That is what they have been telling telling Nigerians. And when let police go after them, do their investigation, they won't do it. Umbano, they won't say anything. They don't say. They don't want. They just these people. Eh, there's something else. <laughs> Well, you are busy counting your death. Death. Can you remember how many people your so-called Fulanis have sent to early grave? He wants compensation as you bandits. Therefore, he call it countless. Uh -huh. I said this. I hope uh, this, the, these people are not going to be forcing the southern governors to pay them to pay them compensation or to give them amnesty. Where are the urban or animal cops to ascertain this claim? When I saw Andre S. make it, I rushed to check what is really happening. Hmm. They have very bad people. How come How come about 100 of you died and you as a Diaseriki see, <laughs> see alive? Those that live by the sword definitely shall die by the sword. If you bring out the list of names and addresses of those kids among the Fulani S-men, why asking so uh, much question we need more of them to die okay unfortunately they have no permanent home the Sarek Fulani is lying this is a cook up stories it's all face face saving and after thought news from the piece of hair huh Fulani where will now where will she be every every wave everybody's calling your name and it's, it does not uh, uh, give you uh, worries 